When I had COVID, these men brought me food in the hotel room. You know? Only guys that came to see me. We start life for you. That's right, man. Love you. I'll do it again. Man Ajit. brought me when I had the Rona. Who did you get COVID they, from? I got co I got from COVID me. from Mel Gibson. One hundred percent. Yo, that's the biggest bar ever. It's real life. He was the only one talking in my face during the prelims of the fights. We're at the Badmash Secret, Secret Kitchen. Yeah, we're at the Dr. Doofenshmirtz Laboratory. It's in the back of this fine establishment, Burgers 99. This is one of my funnest days ever. I love these two men right here. I love their parents, you know, like they have a beautiful family and you can just tell in their eyes they're good men. This is what happens when you go to an Indian person's house. Everyone's excited, sit down, let me feed him. All these situations that you do, all the little tricks. That's really unbelievable. This is the sandwich we used to grow up eating, man. Damn, son. Oh. What? Motherfucker. <laughs> They're very highly intelligent. They're passionate. They're sweethearts. I don't think I've ever liked fish as much as I like this fish right here. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. This is a brand new Babas White. Cheers with my heart. Cheers to the heart. We've been talking about this for years now. Every time I spin it out, it's gonna look crazier and crazier. Yo, Lee. Oh, my own, I mean. Notice the cup. The yes. mad ethnic cup. My, my favorite cup, in fact, our family's favorite cup. And I want to say this for the whole world to know, these boys make me Very, very proud. <laughs> Don't cry. Don't cry. <laughs> My gosh. This is our burger place. It's named Burgers 99. And we're right here in the middle of Los Angeles on La Brea. It's the happiest burger place in the world. Here in LA, our first restaurant is Budmash. We're celebrating 10 years. So we opened it about 10 years ago in downtown LA. We do Indian food and uh, we serve it from our perspective. It's just two young brown bulls out of uh, Markham, Ontario. We met Action in like 2014 when he, I think he was shooting Ancient Aliens. <laughs> and he hit us up and he's like, yo, I need all this food. And we parked outside and Dad and I got out of the car and Dad was like, I'm not going in there, it smells like weed. <laughs> <laughs> and I just remember entering the studio and it was just this like massive hot box. Today, I mean, I, we wanted to do something special so we're serving Bronte's stuffed breads that my mother is actually going to make. I think she makes uh, the best Brontes in the world. Every brown kid thinks their mother makes the best Bronte in the world. Until they try our mom. <laughs> yeah, for real. That's the atta, the dough, and we're stuffing it with like a spice grated cauliflower. Cauliflower is just hard because it doesn't have any starch. Once you add salt, then it kind of gives up all its liquids, right? Yeah. So it's just difficult to roll them. They just have to do it with love and patience. Do you ever cook in your restaurant? What do you think? Welcome to America. You have to do everything. This is the pre-cook. This is to get it prepped so that we can actually fry it with some oil or some butter. Get it really nice and crispy on the outside. That is part of the secret of why hers is better than yours. You heard me. And there I go, burnt my hands right there. Oh! <laughs> Hey, how are you? How are you? How are you? Let me go say, um, give me a second, I'll be right there. Let me go say hi to the big, I gotta say hi to the big chief. Very good to see you. Honor to have you here. Oh, it's an honor for me, thank you. What's up, baby? Good to see you. Everything good? Damn, you're feeling like I know, my lats. Muscle and bone. That's how I, I like to, I like to hug like that so anyone can feel my lats. Jet I'm about to go eat all kinds of fire with my mans. That goes into the pool, you know? No, no, we squeeze it up. I want you to have the soup. Do that? You can just eat that like a salad. 
That's good for a cold. Yes. That's why Knuckle always likes that one. He's always cold. He's always he gives, He's always chilly. He yeah. ate that. So he ate the cauliflower one all the time. And then I would want the alu pronti, which is potato. I haven't added salt. It's all right. Let me get the gist. This is a very good way of using the leftovers and tricking your children. Ah, uh, <laughs> putting the vegetables the into the bread, right? Exactly. This is like the twice fried. The cold butter on the hot pronti. Just a little sample. This is a fish kebab. It is marinated in garam seeds, some Indian spices, lemon juice, ginger garlic, and lots of love. What fish do we have here? They said it's grouper. <laughs> we don't actually know. <laughs> oh! My dad just made some fish kebabs. It's ridiculous. Grouper. Maybe. Possibly. It's ridiculous. It's crack. When I came through the door, they just blew off the, my socks with the with the fish. Yeah. Like this flavor on that shit was incredible. Like I'm inside like I like fish when it doesn't taste like fish at all. Yeah, yeah. Like zero flavor of fish. That shit had just flavor of the spice and just the love they put into it. Ice spice fish. Oh, this is beautiful. This is unbelievable. This is gorgeous. This is so good. This is so good. It's unbelievable. That's the winner. Mint chutney. I want to like just do like a little bite, bite, bite. Try that. Yummy. This is a sour mango pickle. Funk. Intense. Sour. Like hits you right over the head. Mango pickle. Yeah. Savory. Yeah. So it's not sweet like the last one. That's my shit. Mm. Did you guys oh. grow up eating this? Yep. Yeah. Oh. This is a weekend. Uh, oh, this is a weekend right? situation oh. right here. Right? Uh, How different is this from the one you guys grew up eating? It's the exact same. It's incredible. I can eat this all day. Al, you hungry, right? Yeah. The way they spiced it is like, Wait. come on. That fermented mango is ridiculous. That's ridiculous. They got the sweet one and the funky one. It's fucking amazing together. How you make them crisp like this? Double fried. Yo, the fish on top of that, open face with the different things on it is stupid. I'm gonna go to that fish market with your pops. We'll slap the shit out of that guy who gave him this. Yo, this is fucking banging. I don't think I've ever liked fish as much as I like this fish right here. That's really unbelievable tasting. Wow. Yeah. That's obscene. That keema, ground beef, heavily spiced and salted, and then we kind of uh, balance it out with sweet peas. We make ours with beef. We're like rebels. Like, nobody does that. I'm enjoying this so much, guys. Thank you so much, huh? This is incredible, chefs. So on weekends when our mom would make Kima, we'd eat it with Wonder Bread. And uh, when Arjun and I learned how to cook, we actually started sandwiching the Wonder Bread with Kima and then toasting it with butter. I love when you eat this type of shit, man. It makes me happy. This is the sandwich we used to grow up eating, man. Damn, son. Come on. Let's eat this like brothers. Uh. <laughs> you got the that, spoils, man. That? Motherfucker. <laughs> this is what happens when you go to an Indian person's house. Oh my god. It's like sit, everyone's excited. Sit down, let me feed him. That's egg? Oh wow. Not even a breakfast, like you can eat that anytime. What do you have a cup of now? Cup of lassi. Real lassi. Yeah. When I had COVID, these men brought me food in the hotel room. You know? The only guys that came to see me. We our life for you. That's right, man. Love you. I'll do it again. COVID. Man Ajit. brought me, when I had the Rona. Who did you get COVID they, from? I got, co I got from COVID me. from Mel Gibson. Yeah. 100%. <laughs> Yo, that's the biggest bar ever. It's real life. 
He was the him. only one talking in my face during the prelims of the fights. Analyze the DNA from your sneeze and it came up in it Mel came, Gibson. It came up, Passion it's of the ugly. Christ. <laughs> he got caught red-handed. <laughs> I know that bastard gave it to me. This is the best wine on earth right now, you know that? This is my man Babas that made this wine, La Navina. Yo, bro, Babas made this one. This is a brand new Babas white. This is what I chill with in Paris, this winemaker. Cheers with my heart. Cheers to the heart. To the heart. Brothers. Pans? Yeah, two bowls. One for eggs, one for crumbs. Buttered chicken parmesan. Created by us. That's it. Nobody else. Don't let them fucking lie to you. Beautiful. Blitz up the panko. You got some egg? Yes. yes. That's beautiful, senor. So gracias. Un poquito más. So we're gonna use the delicious sauce from their butter chicken. And we're just gonna make fucking cutlets, fry them hard. Mozzarella, put them in the fucking salamander. Fucking put as much goddamn spice into an egg. Chop serranos. This one's a little dangerous. What do we have here? Chop masala. Salt. Yeah, Is it like the black salt? Use that olive oil. Fuck it. That olive oil is good for frying. You need to punch it a little bit. You want to just punch it. I I want these little crevasses. These little textural nodules. Never put the chicken in the way I just did. I only do it because I know what I'm doing. Always lay it away from you. I never knew this until I moved to New York. Seriously, you never had that? What? I, I thought everybody food. ate polio yeah. string yeah, cheese yeah. growing up. Never heard about Absolutely it. Not. Paprika spice mix, it's fucking layered up pretty sick. Don't drown it, but cover it, but leave some nooks. Beautiful. That's perfect. Go fresh herbs underneath so the cheese preserves it. You have black pepper, brother? Like cracked? Oh, we're looking good. This shit's sick. It's a beast. It's built for volume. Every time I spin it out, it's gonna look crazier and crazier. Really? Oh, my own to me. Chicken Parmesan. We made this in January. We made it at the house. Yeah, at the house. We went to Action's house in Venice. And we just had this sick idea, man. Sick I've been dreaming of this. I've literally been dreaming of this. Flavor's good, flavor's strong. Crazy. Thank you. I'm really not trying to miss a piece of cheese here. Not that crunch. That's what I fucking went for. That's why we put it in that shit. Try that piece. Crazy? Oh yeah.